What'd you find, Cindy? I don't know. What on earth? I'm just a girl, a wonderful girl. Hello, Chris, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be visiting two Goodwills today. This one that we're going into first is in Salem, Indiana. So let's go see what we can find. We got little cows and a chicken. Ooh, that's a cow shelf. That's a little different. Oh, I just sold some of these like this. Mine were Mackinac Island. These don't say where they were from. Look at all those Avon bottles up there. Got a little teapot. I'm a little red ware teapot. Oh, look at this. It's like a little cowboy. I guess he can hold your change. What'd you find, Cindy? I don't know. What on earth? Look, he got away. That, is he monkey? I don't know. That's weird. It's a really pretty uh, restaurant wear mug. I like that little design on it. I wonder if the saucer is somewhere here, but it is 99 cents. Keep calm and carrot on. That's a nice big mug though, but I don't care it. I, it's supposed to be like carry on, I think. So they must have a dog named Kronk. Oh, right. The water, the water for Kronk. The water chosen specifically to water Kronk, Kronk's water. Oh, Canada. Oh, bed bugs. Something that you never really want to find at Goodwill. Well, I bought a purse for me. That's all I bought. So we're hopefully we'll have some better luck at the next Goodwill. We'll see. We, we have arrived at Goodwill number two of the day. This is the Goodwill in New Albany, Indiana. So let's check it out. Look. Look, he kept saying Happy Valentine's Day. What else do we got? We've got... What is this thing? Do you put your booze in there and serve your booze out of that thing? I don't know. This is not the one I was thinking of that we wanted to go, but we'll see if we can find anything in here. There's a little lacquer rock, like a lacquer paint over it. This looks like a, uh, like a blue bird of happiness bird, but it's clear. But I'm gonna get it for $1.99. I think somebody might be able to use that in their displays. This is the bottom of a fairy lamp. Maybe we can find the top. We'll put it in the we'll put it in the cart. But this is a they were taking things off the shelves and putting them in, in this cart. So I don't think that the other part of it is in here, but we'll have to look and see if we can find the other half. That's our goal. That's our goal. Well, that's a crappy witch. Oh, she's a planter. Look at her. <laughs> I like her though. Look, here's a ball with cats. Love Amanda. But it has this like little, um, look, it's got this little thing right here. Let me pull this out. I can get it out here. Come on. There, there is the stand. And look, put that there. Ooh, those cats on there and their flowers and their butterflies. This is a little dog glasses holder. He'll hold your glasses. I like to find these. I've sold them many, many times. They're pretty fun. See, you put him down here and you take your glasses off and then you put him on and then he will hold your glasses. So we left that Goodwill and I got the dog glasses holder. Couldn't find the lid for the fairy light. So I got the dog glass holder. I got um, the little clear bird and a couple books. But now we're at a third Goodwill and I got Cindy with me still. Hi. All in New Albany. This is the Goodwill where I found that really, that Build-A-Bear that I got $100 for. So this was a really nice Goodwill. So hopefully we're going to, it's going to be good. It looks good. It's going to be good. So let's go. You see some you see some hats over here. And I like hats. So, let's see if there's any hats. Ooh, there's a fancy red hat. But I don't see any hats for me. Wait, what's this one? Ooh, that one's kind of cute. 
Uh, maybe not. But I wanted to go back here and look to see if we could find any more plush. They have like really clean and a lot of nice plush. Look at this. Big old giraffe. But yeah, this is where I found that builder bear that I could. Oh, there's a Snoopy. Do you do something? Cindy loves Snoopy. Wonder what he does. We'll have to show him to Cindy. Well, here is another Snoopy. He's tired. He's got his little Snoopy. That's Joe Cool. We'll show him to Cindy. Cindy likes Snoopy. We got Papa. Hi, Papa. And then a oh, little hand sewn bear. These little dinosaurs, those are cute. There's Joe Cool again. Dinosaur. Oh my gosh, the dinosaur is adorable. A little Stegosaurus. Oh, and an octopus. <laughs> They've got cute plush. Okay, let's look down here. No, I'm not seeing anything else. Look, there's a little peep the little people house. It doesn't have Oh, that was something else. It doesn't have the people in it though. Okay. Here's Build a Bear Olaf. There's a little uh cast horse. It's kind of neat. A little bronze cast horse. Well, we didn't buy anything. I had high hopes. Usually that's what happens. When you have high hopes, mm -hmm. you don't find anything. When you go, when you walk in your, and you think it, it ain't going to happen today, that's when you tend to find things. So, um, yeah, well, uh, I guess we'll just try a Goodwill another time. Another time. But we tried, didn't we? We did. Hello, it's me. I'm back. I'm at a different Goodwill though, because this is what I have to do. I have to go to multiple Goodwills to get one Goodwill video. So I'm in Seymour, Indiana at a Goodwill, and we're going to try to get this Goodwill video finished up here in the Seymour Goodwill. So let's go see what we can find. Seymour Goodwill with Mark. I have actually, I have actually found a few things in here from time to time and I did not get a cart which means I'll find stuff probably let's see they did just open not too long ago oh look it's like a little bootleg dream circles this is the uh, fall section it seems like um, gosh we got big boxes down here of Christmas ornaments Christmas ribbons, assorted Christmas stuff. Probably maybe some decent things in those boxes, but I'm not gonna, oh, that's on a record. That's different. The Ramblin' Rose, Gordon the Gray. What was this one? It's a Victor. Well, that's a shame. Oh, look at the little. A little otter. He's cute. Here's the pink section. Here's a vintage baby planter, but I don't ever get the baby planters. Usually don't do pretty well for me. It's a cute little Easter. I know the little. He's cute. Oh, there's a flamingo for Jeffrey. Here's a little bunny. But yeah, there's not a whole lot of things on the shelf, which is common. They're like shrink wrapping all this stuff together, but at least they are doing, tape. yeah. Well, and they're putting the makes it a little bit hard to see if there's like damage on some things. But the salt and pepper shakers at least are going together. This is a little happy anniversary thing. What is this? I'm not sure what that's all about, but I don't, it's making it a little bit difficult to see if there's damage on things though. A little teapot. But I suppose they have their reasons. Try to keep things together. Instead of just pricing everything separate. But. Yeah, see here's the lid. Oh, here's a. This is a. I've, I've uh, $2.99 though. It's 
is vintage. A little Lucite or acrylic cube with the Capitol and the Washington Monument in it. Look at the little anthropomorphic popcorns. That's cute. Mark found some squeegees. This was kind of neat too, this cross. It's like a terracotta pottery, it's not old. Got some bunnies and some people. Um, this is the red section. Let's see what's going on in the green section. This bunny's a little cute. He's modern, but he's kind of cute. Hmm. This is vintage, but mm. oh, this is what is this? This is La Belle China. This is an antique piece here. It's got a repair right there, though. But hey, seen some antiques on the shelf of the Goodwill is that's a good thing to see, right? Mark found a big piano. Yeah, it's from FAO Shorts. Yeah, play the piano. It makes, big. yeah, big. yeah, big. I remember. Oh, here's a dinosaur skeleton. Ah. There's a dinosaur. Not. Let's see if we see any squishmallows here. Oh, big, big dinosaur up there. Um. No, it's not gonna be like that. One Goodwill. Oh, here's a big bunny. Cotton candy scented bunny. I don't think I'm gonna smell it. Oh, that's a hard pass on that. But that one Goodwill that had all those squishmallows. This one doesn't have any squishmallows. What? You need squishmallows. No, I don't need squishmallows. But they're on. They're on my. No, no, no. We don't need. We don't need dog shoes either. This is kind of like a random beauty section oh my gosh rave this is old from the 90s oh my gosh do they still sell rave i wonder i wonder if there's a date on it rave shampoo but that is such a 90s bottle oh my gosh here's another i mean that's like there's like nothing even in that why is that even on the shelf for 99 cents but do you remember that she looks like carol ann from poltergeist Johnson's No More Tangles spray on cream rinse. I haven't heard it called cream rinse in a long time. But here is, this is kind of cool. This Disney's Pinocchio puzzle. This is probably from the 90s as well. I would go out on a limb and guess. It's $1.99. Sometimes you can see the dates on the sides here. I'm not seeing it, but I'm going to scan the barcode and see if it's worth anything. Okay, I scanned the barcode on my eBay app and they have brand new ones that were selling for like $19. So this one's not brand new, it's been open, but still Pinocchio. Let's see, in the way of linens, we've got some Christmas dog fabric. It's kind of cute, it's not vintage. I usually don't buy a lot of Afghans. I don't, I have not really done well with Afghans. I know other people can. I've just not done very well with them. They've got a lot of linens here. So Mark found these LED lights. They do plug in the wall. He tested them over there. So probably to go along with my whatnot sale area, we're just going to go ahead and stock up. They're $1.49 a box. So I mean, you really, it's a really great price. I think we're going to get some of those. Well, we bought nothing but those lights. And Mark squeegee so I'm still gonna go to another Goodwill and we're gonna see but I'm telling you this is what this is what it's like here there 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 just really isn't there just really isn't much that you can find at Goodwill's in my area and we're about 45 minutes from my house so it, it's slim pickings when at the thrift stores where I'm where I'm at. Let me know in the comments how is it where you are. Okie dokie, artichokies. I'm at an I, I'm at my little local Goodwill. There it is, right there. And this I don't even know how many trips this is into Goodwill to make one video out of it, but that's what we kind of have to do. So I'm gonna go in here. I haven't been in here in a week. There is a lady. 
right there feeding those seagulls. I don't know why we have seagulls in this parking lot. Seagulls hang out in this parking lot. We are not near a body of water. And I mean, we're like 30 miles from a body of water. But seagulls have always liked to hang out in that parking lot. It's the weirdest thing. Anyway, I'm going into Goodwill. We'll see if we can find. Well, I donated these. Those were, that was my contribution. Look, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I don't think that those are vintage. Checking out the lemons first. Not really seeing anything. Ooh, that is a cool lamp though. This is a decanter, I believe. You're a decanter, but you are a lamp. You're $5.99. Let's see. I mean, I think it's pretty cool. It's missing a harp. We can get a harp easily for it, but wow, well, I think I'm going to get this lamp for $5.99. The cord looks okay. Okay, well, maybe it's going to be a good day. All right, this is not a decanter. It was actually a lamp as well. There's the hole. That's kind of neat too. It's $4.99. It isn't hard to, you know, turn these this back into a lamp, but I think I like that other one a little bit better. Checking out the plush. Just briefly looking at, at it. I'm not seeing anything that requires me to dig my hands in. Here is a little um, Disney castle with carriage. There's that. Oh, how much was it? I don't think it's licensed Disney. It's $2.99. It's got some dog princess on there. So this is the one aisle that the music is always playing down and there's really not anything else on the shelf that I'm seeing at the moment. Well, I got the lamp, I got me some pajamas, and I got two of these shelves, which I like to use on the shelves at the shop. Everything else I got at other places, not at Goodwill, but that's what I got today. So it wasn't horrible but the thing that's horrible is I is the music so loud I, I I film for a little bit and then I, I can't film anymore so that's not the way I wanted to wrap up this video and I keep thinking I'll just go to one more I'll just go to one more goodwill I'll just add another one to it but hopefully this will be enough for this video but I tell you goodwill just is not a great place for me personally all the other stuff that I got back there came from antique malls that's where I can find things for resale. And I prefer it that way because that way I'm also supporting other small businesses. And, you know, instead of, you know, I know that Goodwill does good things with the money. So they say, and so there's that whole aspect of it too. But I tell you, there's just, there isn't much. There is not much. So that's the Goodwill video. I don't know how many more of these I can make. <laughs> this may be the last Goodwill one for a while. Look, the Goodwill videos are the ones that people want to watch and they want to see. And I so wish that, you know, more people wanted to see the antique mall videos because that's where the more interesting stuff is. If you live in the Midwest, let me know. Listen, I know if you live out on the East, they could they could, they tend to be a little bit better. If you live out in the West, they tend to be about a little bit better. But the Midwest, we have great antique malls. So that's I'm that's all I have to say about that. But I I did my best, Goodwill, and Goodwill video loving people. But um, it's just not it's just not good. It's not good, Goodwill. It, it was mediocre today. It was mediocre today. Anyway, that is going to be the, that's going to wrap up this series of Goodwill videos. I hope that you enjoyed it. It, 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 it was something, but, um, it is what it is. That's just, that's, that's typical. It's typical for my area. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up. Thank you guys so much. This was a couple weeks worth, a couple weeks worth of videos wrapped all into one. So hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, leave it a thumbs up. Make sure you leave me a comment. Let me know in the comments. How are your Goodwills? Are they good? Are they plentiful? Do you find things, I mean, I find things for myself in there, like the pajamas and stuff, but even that's slim pickings, even that is slim pickings, but let me know in the comments how the Goodwills are in your area. 
and um, and let me know why you think Goodwill videos are the ones that everybody seems to really, really like. I don't get it. I just don't. But, you know, we keep on trying in hopes of maybe, maybe one day finding something good. But leave me a comment. Let me know how your Goodwills are. And I will uh, see you in the next one, guys. Bye. Red hot mama, red hot mama, you're the one we need. Red hot mama, some drama, yes indeed. They say that I should be in the follies, hot tamales. They say that I got a pair of eyes just like old Svengali's. I confess that I possess the sweetest charms in town. And unless I miss my guess, the boys will follow me around. I could make a music master, drop his fiddle, make a bald head, a man part his hair in the middle.